Y'all, we've done so many amazing games and tours all over Tokyo, but there's only one spot where we're asking you to get on a bus, and that's for the Tokiwaso Manga Museum. Emily's making a phone call to her parents right now to tell them how cool this place is. And there's a story behind this phone booth, actually, because this is a recreation of an apartment from the 1950s. And that phone booth was the only phone booth that the residents of this apartment had to access the outside world. And what kind of tenants were here at the Tokiwaso Museum? What kind of apartment could you turn into a museum? Well, this place housed like some of the most famous manga artists of all time. You see, back in the 1950s, struggling manga artists would pool their resources together. And they lived in these really small four and a half tatami sized rooms. And they've done up this museum so you can see what it was like to live here back in the 50s when the creators of well, Astro Boy, Doraemon, Rose of Versailles, just a lot of the most famous manga artists in history got their start. If you want to take a step back in time and see what Japan was like during the Showa era, and to see, well, honestly, some of the humble origins of the world's most famous manga, then you gotta come check out the Tokiwaso Museum on our manga tour of Ikebukuro. Go to walkingtours.tokyo now.